I'm Abigail Hankey with your NBC 26 update. Monday morning, hunters will find out if they've been selected to take part in the first wolf hunt in Wisconsin in years as the season begins today. It comes after the wolf was removed from the federal endangered species list in January. Some say the decision to allow the hunt was made too quickly. Others say the wolf population in Wisconsin needs to be managed. The season runs through Sunday, February 28th. Governor Tony Evers signed a bill allowing pharmacy technicians and students to administer COVID vaccines. They'll be allowed to give vaccines as long as they have met a certain level of training and are being supervised. The governor says he wants to maximize the number of people able to give out the vaccine. With that, almost 14% of Wisconsin residents have received at least one shot of the vaccine. In Brown County, that's over 36,000 people and more than 19,000 residents have completed the series. Now with all this snow, it's hard to believe spring is on the way, but maybe this will convince you. The new sign outside the Milwaukee Brewers Stadium is going up. The first piece of the new American Family Field sign was attached Sunday afternoon to the side of the ballpark. So far, the letters L and D of field are up on the stadium. I'm meteorologist Michael Fish, and it's actually going to be kind of a mild day today. Kind of blustery, though, too, with some breaks of sun. Now, as far as tonight, a weak disturbance is going to move its way on through. With it, you notice just a couple of these scattered snow showers, maybe a, even a little wintry mix. Any accumulation out of that is actually going to be pretty minor, if anything at all, and it's out of here by tomorrow. Though your temperature today going well above average, 37 degrees for you. As far as tonight, again, a couple of those scattered snow showers, and for tomorrow, maybe 40 and blustery. We'll keep the mild air going for a lot of the rest of the week. Another chance of a little bit of snow on Sunday.